So right now, the world is playing a game of whack-a-mole against the Omicron variant. The big question, of course, will it evade the vaccines we already have? But what if you had a vaccine where that wasn't even an issue? This is biochemistry at work. In this laboratory at the University of Washington School of Medicine, they're coming up with vaccines that would not only protect us from today's deadly coronavirus, but from coronaviruses that haven't even evolved yet. Viruses have names, and SARS-CoV-2 is the virus that causes COVID-19. Out of this lab, they've created a special type of vaccine against it, now in human testing. This is a model of the vaccine that's right now in phase three clinical trials, which is really exciting. Lexi Walls is a scientist here. This model represents a vaccine made in that lab. The important thing is its shape. It is not alive, but made of incredibly small bits of protein that mimic what the virus looks like to a human cell. That's different than an mRNA vaccine that's used in the Pfizer and Moderna shots. We're giving the physical protein versus giving your body the instructions for how to make the protein. But you're basically is... giving the body a fake. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. That's a great way to say it. The development of those particles and vaccines is happening in this lab. Marcos Miranda is a research scientist. The plan is to use that idea of shape to take another big step. You see, the virus that causes COVID is part of the same family of viruses that caused earlier but less serious disease outbreaks in recent decades. Remember SARS and MERS, they all come from one big family and have elements in common, opening up the possibility of a universal vaccine. The universal would cover more than just variants. It would cover the entire family of coronaviruses or the entire family of um, beta coronaviruses. What is highlighted up here is that Achilles heel, that receptor binding domain. The common elements could prove key. Teach the body to recognize one virus, it could recognize all of them. It's still all this whack-a-mole game. Yep. This gets you beyond that. That's the hope, yeah. We're still in preclinical testing, but the goal is to get a vaccine that no matter what variant comes, you have the defenses and you're ready. So the question now, when could this vaccine become available? The answer is, we don't know but they promise they are working as quickly as possible. In Seattle, Glenn Farley, King 5 News.